Get to meteorologist Sam Schreier now on your Thursday morning. Not a bad morning for one of those jackets, those coats, Bree, because it is uh, it is a little frosty outside. There's actually parts of Colorado Springs where we are below freezing. Our airport sensor says 36. Our studio right here just off of Rock Rim and, uh, and across from Pulpit Rock, we're reading like 33. So it's a little bit chillier up and in the north end of town, which we often get. Pueblo, so we were at 28. 5 o'clock rolled around. We've warmed up a couple degrees. 31 is the current temperature. We don't have a lot of wind out there, and the humidity is not overly high either. Oh boy, cold in the valleys. Alamosa 16 West Cliff, or Alamosa 14 West Cliff is 16. 22 out in the open plains of Lyman. Lamar is awfully chilly this morning, and we're 34 up into Denver. So kind of a mix of 30s and a few 20s mixed in. Obviously colder in the valleys. High temperatures today. We're forecasting a mix of 60s outside from Colorado Springs to Pueblo, just about 70 into Lamar, and then some 50s back west into the mountains and valleys. For instance, Woodland Park is 57 today. Now let's talk about the forecast. Kind of a fun low pressure pressure area over the Pacific Northwest. It's throwing some rain and cloud cover a little thicker over Washington and Oregon, and there's a little bit of a dip that'll try to bring some cooler air across the northern Rockies, but actually Colorado, I don't think we get any influence here. We're going to keep warming over the next few days because in our jet stream pattern, not only is there some downsloping flow out of the northwest that travels across the Rockies, we're just building a nice ridge pattern in between a cooler pressure system to the east and that Pacific cool air off to the west. We can track this pretty easily over the next few days. So Thursday into Friday, that ridge pattern swells and builds a little bit. So tomorrow looks warmer, but we really get established going into the weekend. So Saturday and Sunday. High temperatures will be well into the 70s across the plains, but we do track a little bit of a cool down into next week. Lows tonight will still be chilly, not as cold as what we're seeing this morning, but we'll be back into the 30s and some 20s all mixed together. Then tomorrow we will warm into the 70s and we'll have some 60s spread out west. Let's hit traffic.